Hey guys, take a moment to video for you guys. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to force restart your MacBook in a few different ways. Now, something you want to do if your MacBook is frozen, screen isn't working, you're having issues with apps or any software related issue, this is the very first go to steps that you want to do. So, let's get started. So, in order to force restart your MacBook, what you'll do is on a newer MacBook, locate the power or the touch button, which is usually the very top button up here right there. And you're going to press and hold until the screen goes completely black and then you let go of that button. So I'm going to do it now. As you can see here, lock me out and the screen went completely black. And we're going to wait a few seconds and then let go of that button. Now after it shuts down completely like this black screen, give it a moment or so to completely shut down. And all we do after that is press and hold this button again until you see the Apple logo appear and you hear that noise and then you can let go of that button and this is doing a force restart which again it's going to reload the software of the MacBook so if you're having any issues with the software related issue it will fix those issues for you now all of your data will still be on your MacBook if you do have an app or anything that had unsaved work it might actually delete that but your personal data that's already on there will not get deleted. And after we have done that, we're going to be able to go ahead and log back into our MacBook and start using it. Now, the second method, if this method isn't working, if you have an older MacBook, you might need to press three buttons at the same time. The control, the command, and then the power up top here. So you want to do hold them at the same time until the screen goes black. So as you can see here, I'll just hold it like this. So that's control, command, and the power. And again, same exact thing, I'm going to wait till the MacBook goes black. And then once it goes black, I let go of those buttons. Same exact thing, this time I'll hold, again, the power until the Apple logo appears. And it's going to do another force restart just like that if the original method didn't work. Now we're going to show you another way to force restart your MacBook if these buttons didn't work or the first method didn't work as well. And that's going to be a 3 v button combination that you could also try and this is going to be some troubleshooting that you want to do. So we're back again and now this time we're going to do control option and then we're going to do command as well. So control option command along with the power or the touch button up top. So use three fingers and your power button at the same time you're going to press and hold just like I am as you can see here I'm pressing and holding these three buttons and waiting for the screen to go black again and once it goes black let go give it a few seconds and again hold that power button until the Apple logo appears and again this time we have done another force restart so those three different ways to try to force restart your MacBook if you're having issues and hopefully once you've done a force restart your MacBook is working the way it should and everything should be good to go so I hope this quick little video was helpful. If so, please make sure to like and subscribe button. Thanks for watching, guys. See you guys next time.